Let's go ahead and take you outside with our Skyview 2 network overlooking Daniel Island right now. I've been seeing the camera shake just a little bit early this morning just because of our northeasterly breeze today. A strong northeasterly wind. We're seeing wind gusts up to 20, possibly even 30 miles per hour as you get a bit closer to the coast today. So. And there it goes right there. Daniel Island right now. Let's show you what this looks like on Storm Team 2 Live Viper Radar. A few of us waking up to some heavier rain, some showers early this morning. Zooming in on a few of these areas, a long line right here, stretching from Hollywood all the way up to Somerville. You guys are waking up to some raindrops, a few raindrops in the metro as well. And this is the general idea for your Saturday. Could be seeing a few passing showers outside, uh, gusty winds at times. If not, you're dealing with cloud cover outside. We're within the low 70s to start off, 72 near Charleston, 72 in Goose Creek, 70s in King Street with 73 in St. George and 72 waking up in Walterboro this morning. And throughout the rest of your morning hours, clouds, breezy, passing showers, that's the idea for your Saturday. No, it's not going to be an all-day washout, consistent rain type of event, uh, but it's still not that perfect boat or beach day you may be wanting for your weekend. Low 80s as you head towards Charleston, 83 near King Street, 80s in Monk's Corner, 82. In St. George, current wind gusts right now, now measured a 25 mile per hour wind gust in Charleston. I'm not surprised by that. I mean, I've walked outside in between the breaks and you kind of feel the wind out there immediately. So breezy at times today. And of course, going to see a few passing showers. That wind's going to last up until uh, this weekend, even into early Monday as well. I'll show you Monday on the uh, 10 day forecast as well. But right now, Storm Team 2 Vipercast by 10 o'clock has us mainly staying dry in a few areas, still dealing with a few passing showers by 1 or 2 o'clock. And then here comes some heavier rain as you get that way. But you notice this isn't a consistent washout. This isn't even like last weekend on Sunday. I know we were dealing with uh, that consistent downpour within the metro area. Now, as you head towards your evening hours, I know we have a lot going on in the low country this weekend. You want to get out the door. Just keep your umbrella and keep your rain gear close by. This is a forecast we're closely going to watch as we roll on right into Sunday and Monday as well as we do have that low pressure system could form offshore and bring us some more rain and some more issues as we get towards early next week. We'll continue to keep you updated on that, but clouds and breezy overnight tonight. The best way to stay up to date on the forecast is through the Storm Team 2 weather app that's available in the Apple App Store, Google Pay, Play. You have radar right there in your pocket. Saturday and Sunday, most of us going to be in the low 80s, still dealing with showers and storms. By Monday, we're going to be closer to that right now. We're going to be seeing some rain, going to be dealing with a rip current risk, high surf as well. And here are your islands and beaches forecast breezy near the coast today, dealing with off and on showers through the weekend.